Good afternoon everybody! Welcome back to the channel. Today is a beautiful day. It's not too hot for some reason here in the fabulous Las Vegas. I think it's because of the wind. Currently the wind is like trying to balance the hot weather so that's amazing. We're back here in the Spring Valley area. This area is centrally located. In fact, it's about 6.1 miles from the Las Vegas Strip and a lot of shops around. This community is an older community, 1990s surrounding you. However, Lennar bought the land here and you have this beautiful two-story homes. One of them is the Bellevue, which has the next gen. So check out the channel page on the screen if you haven't checked the full video tour of the Bellevue next gen. And that also has a loft area. Now this one, we're gonna feature this one, which is the two-story and 2,000 square feet. We'll be able to check that out, guys. Before we proceed, let's do three things. First, let's subscribe to the channel. Second, let's like this video. And third, let us share this video, right? Hello, guys. <laughs> How are you guys doing? So we have some visitors visiting the community as well. All right, so we are going to tour this together. Don't forget to share this video because sometimes you'll never know there might be people that might be interested in this community especially if they have for example wanting to be able to access this trip right away and then also be able to enjoy the commute because this is an easy one of the easiest commutes so far i've seen in the communities here in vegas if you are trying to be near the strip but at the same time have the convenience of a quiet neighborhood and also i wanted to point out guys i have a lot of quick movings on the screen check out the playlist it has a ready to move in playlist there uh, which is definitely worth yeah, including in your uh, home search because there are a lot of quick movements that i featured on the channel that might interest you and when there is an inventory definitely the right way of trying to get that discount that you were longing for because the builders are willing to sell those inventory faster than of course when you build from the ground up so that's the beauty about if you like the inventory already i'll be there to be able to negotiate it for you okay also this video has a bonus footage of all the currently available homes that you can enter into a contract while they are still under construction but they will be finished during this year okay guys i'm super excited please watch the entire video write your comments by the way shout out to dexter decorchi before i forget it's funny because he was watching my youtube video so that was really cute that's Dexter DeCorgi, thank you so much for watching my video before you sleep at night. And as you can see on the screen, that is called Dexter DeCorgi. Shout out to you. I hope you will have more than 100 or even millions of subscribers in the future once you consistently post videos. Okay, thanks so much guys. Let's begin the tour. Hi there. Before we begin the tour, let me guide you on how to reach Siena Ridge from the Bellagio Fountain. These are the amenities available at Siena Ridge. Shopping. Walmart Supercenter. Walgreens. Island Pacific Seafood Market. The Home Depot. Restaurants. Ike's Love and Sandwiches. Pizza Hut. Mint Indian Bistro. Public Service. NV Energy. Southwest Gas. Cox Communication. Medical Care. Southern Hills Hospital Spring Valley Hospital Schools Clark CoSD Nevada Department of Education Las Vegas Clark County Library District These are the available quick move in homes with their prices. everybody this is the home welcome back to the channel 
It's around 6 18 p.m. and you can see that the sun is still up here in the amazing Las Vegas. And this is the entrance to the community, right? And that is the house that we will tour. They have a bunch of uh, under construction homes that you can buy while they are under construction. So please check out the bonus footage because I showed there the different homes that are available for you to grab while they are still under construction. If you missed the, the uh, YouTube video tour of that particular model with the next gen, please check out to the please go back to the channel page, Lenar playlist, and you'll be able to see that home there. It's the uh, Bellevue model. And this one is the Kingsbury. The Bellevue has a next gen. This one doesn't have. So this one is a nice angular, angular roof line. And you can see there are there is a paver going to your two-car garage. Right? 2051 square feet. And nice, you have a porch, right? This is nice when you have a porch, you'll be able to have a cover before entering the home. Let's do this, guys. Let's enter this beautiful home. Three, be three bedrooms, 2.5 bathrooms. All right, welcome to this beautiful home. Now, this is a nice thin, thick luxury vinyl plank it's very very um long and wide and then you have a grand entrance it's not really that grand but you just have a very high ceiling when you go immediately inside this house 20 feet high okay no, that one is nine feet, right? Okay. And then when you immediately enter this home, you, you see this very open floor plan. You have your dining, your living room, and then the kitchen. This flooring is very nice. This is, it's a luxury vinyl plank. It doesn't justify in the video, but it makes it more interesting because it's so bright that it feels so spacious here and also very clean looking. Now that is the door we entered and then that is the stairs going to the second floor. Now the the idea here at Linar is that whatever you see here is what you get, right? They have this trademark of everything's included but i wanted to make sure you're aware guys that for example this flooring may have been an upgrade right but everything is structural and appliances that you will see on the in the kitchen is included so for example in the models if they say there will be there is a door here on the model then that's how you will get on their spec homes what I know so far that they said that is not included is the uh, upgrade for the flooring, the thickness of the backsplash, I'm sorry, the thickness of the counter, and also the, um, the backsplash are not included. Okay, so this is your dining area, right? Um, when you, one thing I noted, when you're seated on this, at this area of dining, you have immediate view of the TV. Now this wall, guys, is pretty boring to me. What you would, I would suggest if you have this kind of a massive wall, I would put like a very nice wooden design here or like very long fireplace, right? That would be amazing, like uh, electric fireplace. Okay, so you have those uh, garden, not garden, but uh, back here there with a pergola, which we will take a look in a while. 
But this is how it looks like in the meantime. I cannot open this guys because they blocked it. That's how Linar does it. They don't usually allow people to enter from this side of the home. But we'll, uh, we'll be able to see if there is uh, an access at the side yard. Now this is your kitchen. The only thing is they don't provide this um, tree pendant lighting, but definitely will negotiate to include it, right? If you wanted to build. And this is the nice thing about this kitchen is that you have this extended counter all over, right? It's a long counter, guys, all the way there. So this one is the positioning of your one sink. They're giving you this tap water. This is a very standard one. You can definitely replace that easily, no problem. And then this is the backyard. So basically when you're washing your dishes, you can watch over the people that are roaming around your beautiful backyard and enjoying the sun there, especially if you have a pool. Okay, so this one is your view from the very corner of this counter. Now this one is a quartz, right? So if they say that the everything is included, this is included except for the thickness. So if you chose a, a thicker one, then definitely that's an upgrade. This backsplash is not included. And this is easy to do, guys. Don't be disappointed if you don't get it when you move in because this one is very easy to put together. You can actually buy more luxurious looking than that. Okay, so this one is your kitchen cabinet, which we will test. Wow, it is soft closing, amazing. You're gonna get that dishwasher there. So the reason why this is there, the dishwasher, is because once you have the plates there, right, you put it there. If you want to wash it again through the dishwasher. Now, these are very standard, guys. I don't understand why it's not vented. We'll have to ask that. Maybe this is the venting, but I, you know, for me, I still want the, the microwave to vent out, right? This is a very standard stove, guys. You can definitely replace this with a nicer one if you want, but that is what they will give you, including this refrigerator. This is the refrigerator they're gonna give you still good you know for a starter um, refrigerator as long as it's free why not right or me maybe as long as it's included because <laughs> sometimes they don't even provide refrigerator for homes in other communities of Lenar okay so this one is your view when you're at your island very open you can prepare your food here you can watch TV there Make sure you tune in at Angelo Home Tours because I'm featuring a lot of quick move-ins now. I realize that a lot of people are looking at quick move-ins nowadays. They don't want to wait 8 months, 6 months, 11 months to build. And also it's a headache sometimes, right? But, uh, you know, there are still people building. But the, the thing is, if you can discount heavily a quick move-in, then definitely people are going to grab those, right? those inventories but if they don't like the home then definitely they will build meaning the inventories if they don't like the colors then definitely people are tempted to build from the ground up hello guys so basically this is your standard pedal so sink that is your toilet in fact let's check if it's soft closing oh wow it is you're getting a soft closing guys that's amazing this is actually a very spacious half bathroom, conveniently located upon entering the house from the garage. Now, they usually close this. Maybe they are storing their gold and their golds here, right? Just kidding. Okay, so when you enter the home from the garage, this is how it feels. You enter the home, you close the garage, right? Door. And then if you needed to use the toilet, then definitely use it on the right side. Now, the pantry, for example, you have market, right, items 
you went to the grocery and you wanted to stack your uh, food, then this is how you would stack it there. It's a little small. Yeah, it's a small pantry. But you have a lot of cabinetries there, which is nice. Okay, so now you're ready to go. You put your refrigerator, uh, meaning your grocery items, and then you use the toilet, then you're ready to go. Now, this is the right positioning as well because you then have to get water because it's super hot here in Vegas right now during June, July, August. You need it to, to hydrate, right? So you have water there from the refrigerator and then you walk like this and then you sat on at your uh, very comfy couch and then you watch the TV. Isn't it nice to be having that kind of a <laughs> sequence or when you go back home? Okay, now this is going to be the second floor. Now this is a standard carpet. Okay, so we're going to check out the second floor. I wonder if they can get for you a... Um, a railing, a much better railing. This is a pony style, right? I think it will make it open if you have like a beautiful railing there, like a metal railing. Okay, so this is, uh, there's no loft area at this floor plan, but the, the other one, the Bellevue that I already posted has that uh, loft area. You know, I wish Lenar should start doing a balcony because it would have been nice if you have a balcony here, right? Okay, so that is the um, stairs. It's a long hallway of your bedrooms. You really don't have any space to put your table here, guys, because it's going to be too tight. Although you can put there, but you have to make sure that uh, no one is blocking it's not being blocked here okay it's a little darker here so let's turn on the lights thank you so much for all the people who corrected my grammar because i usually says let's open the lights but technically it should be turn on the lights. so thank you so much i like learning a lot guys so Life is a learning process each day, so I appreciate all of you guys who corrected me. Okay, so this one is your first secondary bedroom stage as an office. It has this double window. Okay, that is your pre-wire for your lighting. It's a pretty good size. This is a 12 by 11, I guess. That is just my guesstimate. And then they have this design elements where you can do a lot of your scheduling. Right? Don't forget to go to the sphere once it opens because that is an amazing immersive experience, which is the new attraction here in Vegas. I'm actually going to go there because it's not also very expensive. U2 is the very first band who will have a concert there at the Sphere. Okay, so now this one is your linen closet. Nice that they gave you something to put your towels also. Hello guys. So there is this um, bathroom, full bathroom shared by the two bedrooms. Now, thank you so much to the person who corrected me because this is the fiberglass, right? It's a uh, fiberglass wall surround for this bathtub. And then this one is definitely, maybe this is soft closing. Yes, it is. Wow. And this is a water sense, which is a toilet that meets the EPA criteria okay so they use this nice style here very bright just a little lighter grout which might be challenging when it gets darker challenging to clean this is a very nice cultured marble and you can probably upgrade it to a quartz if you want 
all right, your standard chrome and sync. They didn't put a light there, but they're giving you two recess lighting. Okay, let's check the next secondary bedroom. All right. Also very convenient space. Look at this. They still have some space here. And this is a queen size bed. It looks very homey here inside this bedroom. I guess because of this staging, right? Feels, you feel like you wanted to sleep right away. Okay, so you have a standard closet there. This is probably a 6.5 door. It's not 7 for sure because I've seen 7 maybe at this point. All right, okay. It's a very short door. Okay, this is your laundry area. Now this laundry is not included, meaning the machines are not included. But this is how it feels. They're giving you a tile also. Okay, now we're gonna go to the last part of this second floor, which is your primary bedroom. Now this primary bedroom seems dark to me. I guess it's because they didn't put the recess lighting there. You only have one recess lighting. I mean, pre-wire for your chandelier if you want. But this is a spacious one, guys. Because this is a king size bed and that is a very wide uh, nightstand and you still have some space there. So definitely this is a spacious, that ju doesn't justify in the video but when you go here in person with me, I'll tell you that it, this is quite a, a very nice size primary bedroom. I just would have hoped they have an option for you to put a balcony here, right? Because you want to make sure you can go out and have coffee in your balcony. But again, guys, they didn't put the balcony, sorry. Okay, there is a night, um, dresser here. Hello, guys. They like mirror in front of a dresser instead of a TV. Okay, so we're going to... Wow, how come this is big? <laughs> this is... You know, sometimes I, I kind of like realize that some of the toilet or water closet area there's a lot of space right this could have been somewhere here like you have so many space and then this one is the linen closet okay so you can put your towels there as well and then this is again the tile that they use consistently Double sink. Hello guys. This is a cultured marble. They use the frosted glass so that no one will see you inside anymore, but it brings the light inside. And then they're giving you a shower and a bathtub. This is again a fiber glass. Thank you so much to the one who corrected me. I forgot to mention your name, meaning I forgot your name. But comment down below and I'll be able to shout you out the next time I go on a fiberglass shower. A fiberglass surround shower. Yeah, so this one is pretty standard looking. Nothing really was upgraded on that side of the bathroom. Okay. Ooh, okay. This is, this is quite spacious. Yeah. Yeah, you can walk here easily. This is will even be bigger if you put cabinetry all over. So I'm helping my buyer some somewhere in Ma Summerlin. We're hiring closet, uh, California closet to design his um, closet area. And I'm gonna also do a feature of California closets because they told me they wanted to also promote their product under this YouTube. Okay, so let's go back down, right? This is again your bedroom area. What do you feel about this long hallway, guys? Would you rather have a loft area? 
And again, we're only talking about 2057 square feet here. That's the, probably the reason why it might be tight to put a loft area there. But let me know what you think of this beautiful home. I'd be glad to uh, tour this with you. They have available lots that will be ready in the next few months for you to move in. So comment down below if you'd like to check those out or contact me on the screen. And I really appreciate you guys for your support to the channel. We are growing super fast. Thank you so much. But we haven't gotten there. So I wouldn't be thanking you. <laughs> I wouldn't end this video first. Let's go first to the back, right? So that we can see how it feels. I'm going to go to the side entrance so that we can see this beautiful backyard. Okay, guys. So we're going to try to check out the side yard here. This is the front, right? That's where we entered the house. So your side yard is on this side. Oh wow, what is this? I never saw this inside. Hmm, interesting. Yeah, I never see it from the inside. It might, you know, I'm thinking this might be the door from the garage going outside, right? This one. Okay, so let's check this out. Okay, so definitely this is a good size lot. Where is it in Spring Valley? So therefore, um, there's a chance that you will be able to get a nice lot here. Yeah, this is definitely a very nice size lot. That is the the other home that we toured also. Really nice. This grass looks like real. <laughs> it's so nice, right? It looks very real but it's artificial so they like putting this um pergola here which is also very luxury luxury feeling so imagine right you have a swimming pool somewhere there and you have a pergola to enjoy your uh drinks make sure you this is also something with cover right there's some pergola company where you can just automatically try to open it via a remote control and you will have the roof there's so much technology nowadays guys that will make your life really very pampered this is a nice step here so imagine you have this kind of step very nice and i like that they put a portico or a uh, patio right this is a nice patio what would you do here? Would you put like some table, barbecue, right? So you can entertain your guest. All right. I hope this gave you an idea. Again, guys, the backyard is not included. When they give you the home, you will have a dirt here. So it's up to you to hire a contractor. I probably would guesstimate this between 25 to 30K. Now, it might be lesser. Right? It could be lesser than 25K. Because the reason why I'm just estimating it to 25 is because of that um, pergola there. But this is a nice size yard. You can put a swimming pool there for sure. If you don't need that pergola, definitely it is a very nice size for a pool. Again, guys, thank you so much for all of your support to the channel. I really appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. We reached 4,000 subscribers in just a span of one year. And I hope to uh, get to the 100K sooner because that will help me improve the channel, hire more people to be able to showcase a lot of uh, the details that you needed in your home search. Also, it's going to be very helpful for all of the people that are 
planning to sell their homes because then I'll be able to feature your homes on the channel and we'll reach more viewers, right? We're reaching a lot of people around the United States. In fact, we have Alaskan people, we have Missouri, we have uh, a lot like Chicago, New York, Virginia, New Jersey, East Coast. Not only Californians are moving to Vegas. It's because they see this as a very tax-friendly state. Very, very friendly. Zero state tax, low property tax. Thank you so much. Don't forget to contact me on the screen for more information about this community. I'll be able to speak with you over the phone. That is my number on the screen. Thank you so much and have an amazing day today.